I am a storyteller um, because I'm an actor, I'm a writer, I'm a filmmaker, um, sometimes I'm a musician. Um, I would say in one word, I am a storyteller um, because I'm an actor, I'm a writer, I'm a filmmaker. Um, sometimes I'm a musician. I just do what I can to tell the stories that I want to tell um, in the best way possible. Um, I think I knew that I wanted to be an actor since I was little. I started when I was 10, but I'd wanted to start long before that. Um, I was very influenced by my parents. Um, my dad was a music producer at the time, and so he was very in the entertainment industry. And um, I had gotten into music, but I didn't think that was necessarily what I wanted to do. Mm-hmm. And um, I thought of acting as a really good opportunity. So, um, My dream, uh, I think my dream is to work on uh, science fiction or like Marvel Avengers type of movie. Um, someone I want to work with so badly is Michael B. Jordan, executive <laughs> producer, and I right. want to work with him so badly. Right. He's produced a lot of um, science fiction films for um, uh, black writers, Definitely. and for sure. I mean, it's obvious if you look at any movie or show nowadays, there's always, that's always apparent, and colorism is such a big issue in the film yeah. industry. Mm-hmm. Um, I've noticed too, like, again, with typecasting, you'll notice that more, um, the more stereotypical black woman in shows, um, like, with stereotypes as being the angry black woman is always darker skinned, almost as if Hollywood is trying to portray um, darker skinned women in a bad light. Um, I think I definitely do have an advantage. um, But I think there's something there if I were to be able to get, um, you know, my foot in the door in the industry as a writer, I would obviously want to uplift um, everyone in the Black community. And I wouldn't want it to be, um, you know, another marginalized um, group within the Black community. And so I would say for me, not just as an actor, but as a film writer, as a filmmaker, um, that's an important issue to me because I know that I have an advantage, but I think that from there, I can use the advantage I have. Too. I don't think I've experienced anything to the extent of like outright racism or discrimination against me for my skin tone. Right. Um, I think I've been very lucky on the sets that I've been on. Um, um, I've been very lucky. Most of the directors and filmmakers were women or women of color. And okay. so um, I got lucky there. And I don't think I've ever experienced anything negative. Um, because I think um, a lot of the things we work on here in Atlanta, Atlanta is such an, an urban city. And there's so many great filmmakers and writers here. And it's so diverse that I think um, it's a little better than what you might experience somewhere else. Um, while, you know, Hollywood is great and LA is great, but it's very much a like click, whereas Atlanta yeah, is everyone's sure. building each other up. So I would say, yeah, I've had um, pretty good experiences on set and I've never experienced anything. All right.